I'm Jason with Hatfield RV and today we're going to go over the Gulfstream Trailmaster 279BH which is essentially an Amerilite Gulfstream unit. Uh, this is a rental unit of ours. We have a rental fleet. Uh, however, it's never been titled and you still get all the warranties. So even though it's been used as a rental, it's still um, considered a new unit because we've never titled it. The weight is wrong. The weight on our brochure is wrong. This is roughly 6,000 pounds, not 5,200. Our brochure is incorrect. This have a nice outdoor kitchen there, but it is half ton towable. Um, you know, any any wide range of years of half tons would be able to tow something like this. It's a great floor plan, which is why we use it as a rental. Gulfstream does something a little bit different in their construction that no one else really does. They use hurricane straps to put their um, their their rafters on. No one else really does that, so it just adds to the to the to the structure. It adds to the to the soundness of of the build um, and the Gulfstream products, which is nice. Our other rental fleet, we're using an Oasis brand, a Shasta brand. The Gulfstreams tend to have a little bit taller ceilings in them. They're using doors instead of curtains, which is nice. They're larger slides, so it's a little bit deeper slide, a little bit taller slide. A little bit better upholstery when, we're, when it comes to this versus our Oasis as far as our rental fleet goes. They do a nice job with their kitchen, gives you sound countertop space, large deep dish um, sink there. They're almost always going to come with an oven where Oasis is not going to come with an oven. It is going to have a power awning which is nice. Um, the room in the back, the bunk room, is very great space in this thing. It's got three bunks in there. They've incorporated a step back there so it makes it nice to kind of get up in there. A lot of manufacturers are doing away with with ladders from a liability standpoint. Uh, seems like a few years ago everyone just stopped putting ladders in there and their bunk rooms from a liability standpoint. Uh, very nice shower. It comes with a tub for the kids which is nice. Great sleeping. This unit would sleep nine when you factor in that uh, there's two on the dinette and two in the couch and then three back here and then two up in the queen bed. Great unit. Uh, check it out. HatfieldRV.com or on Facebook at HatfieldRV. Thanks for watching.